Fuck. Fucking shit. Doc, Doc, we gotta get in there before the fucking almighty ends. Oh, fucking shit. They can't fucking see me here. Karen, you see that? Karen! It's my triumphant return to Borgata. <laughs> I'm scared to film anywhere fucking close. Hopefully this will be not a 3 a.m. day. Parkour! Parkour! Last time on Ryan DePaulo Degenerate Gambler. What's up guys? Parkour! He lost eight bullets at parks. Six in the main event and two in the side one day event. First of all, I ate so much McDonald's that I was falling asleep behind the wheel. I had to pull over and sleep for like 10 minutes. I was just at parks today and yet I have DJ Tingles pulling into Atlantic City because this is an entire city of degeneracy. There's just some sick, unexplainable DJ Tingles, you guys. It's my triumphant return to Borgata. L let's not forget here, you know? This is my fucking Napoleon returning from St. Helena or whatever the fuck. Borgata, I'll see you tomorrow. Hopefully this ban is actually lifted and they don't kick me out. It's not a mistake. So we're in the, the great degenerate hallway on the way to check in. We got the tingles again. It's almost like I reset after that 10 minute nap on the drive from parks to here. It was just like a total fucking reset. And now my DJ and tingle like, like synapses are firing again. So let's go. Ooh, let me pick up some shit here. The, the fat boy snack. The atrium? She said I'm upgrading you to the atrium suite. I've never been over here. What? Bro, I didn't even know this was part of Harris. I don't know what the hell this is. Wow. It stinks of cigarettes, but that, that ain't nothing we can't get used to, you know what I'm saying? So we're for real watching the Super Bowl playing slots on our phone because we haven't been in Jersey to collect our Lamar Jackson MVP bet. 25 bucks paid 525 so we cashed that out and we still had some money on there and we so we were gambling a little slots and we hit 36 in roulette and we're just degening out eating some slot machine some fucking vending machine shit. Let's go 49ers maybe they'll win this time. Let's fucking go. Oh my god. So we never played this uh scratch off that we said was like the first bet of the weekend. Uh, it looks like so far the champion has trip jacks. It's gonna be tough to beat. Let's let's go. Let's all go. No, we lose. We're going to bed. See you, DJs, in the morning, bro. Day three. All right. We're going to jump in the almighty stizzle. Our triumphant return to Borgata. We're gonna be low key filming. Like so, like I always say that in the dope, but like I'd be beyond low key, like. I have some slim hopes that someone on the floor from the poker manager will recognize me and then talk to me and tell me a little bit more details of where I can and cannot film. You know, mulligan relationship with this place, but we'll see. <laughs> no, Why not? She's good. Real fucking ghetto hours. I just tried the ATM to take 1600. It says this this terminal does not have sufficient funds to complete your request. Fuck you, Harris. Stupid ass place. Give me all fucking twenties. I hate you, Harris. Uh, I guess you guys won't get to see how I do in the almighty stack, you know? Let's fucking not get arrested. Let's not get kicked out again. Bye, 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 bye. Best behavior. For real, for real. Which probably means for me acting like a normal person. Hey, Stu? Ryan, what the fuck are you doing here? Aren't you banned? You're gonna get us in oh, trouble. Oh, no. A uh, lawyer who's a fan of the channel wrote a letter and I'm reinstated, so this is my first time back. Oh, that's great. Yeah, nice guy. It was cool. So, what do you need? Um, I was just hoping you could maybe help me be on my best behavior for the day. What? My fucking Mary Poppins? I don't know how to do that. Oh, I'm sorry. I just you thought. You just thought what? You know how many casinos I've been banned from? I love you, Rye, but you got the wrong fucking ghost. I would say something inspirational like the powers within you, but I don't fucking think it is. So I don't know. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Unger. <laughs> All right, now for real, I'm gonna register and not film again until the next break, guys, or until I'm safely in the food court, all right? Wish us luck, $400. We're getting staked on this after eight bullets. Isaac putting us in, so wish us luck. All right, so we registered, but I just had to take a break because there's still, we're missing hands, but this place is the fucking worst, dude. We sit down, the guy to my right recognized me from the vlog, I played with him before. We're talking, cursing a little bit, but we're just talking. Then the guy on my left is like, guys, enough with the cursing, enough with the cursing. And we're like, what? Like, what are you talking about? And they like start bickering. He's like, I'm gonna curse, and the floor gets called over. And then it's a whole stupid thing, and I'm like, oh my God, I gotta tap out of this. Then later, the dealer starts crying because she feels disrespected by everybody. Dude, then the fucking guy in seat one 
wins a hand, she grabs his cards and he grabs her hand. He's like, push me the pot first. She's like, no, no, I take the cards first. And he's like, no, you don't. It, this place is the first. And I can't vlog, and now I can't curse at the table. That's the fourth ruling, no cursing. So it's like, this is the ultimate degen challenge. No vlog, no curse. You start with 100K, we got like 88K. There's no hands. We're playing too many hands because it's early and we're just trying to degen a little, get some shit going. Here we are. All right, going back, we ate our sushi. I think I'm missing hands again, but I can't take it. I have this table, so. A few moments later. So we're here on the next break. We got 94K. There's a couple hands. We're about to do the bow ski and sit in the car and update. Yeah, I'm scared to film anywhere fucking close here, but we went up and down. We had 88K coming back. All right, with blinds at 300, 600, with a 600 big blind Annie. We're under the gun plus one, and we have four, six suited of hearts. Whatever, we're degening it up. We're all deep stacked. You start with 100K, we make it 1500. There's two callers. Flop comes. Ace, two, five. Two in the five are hearts. We check, dude bets 1K. Other guy calls, and we decide to check raise. We make it 6K, and then he just snap puts in the better, puts in fucking 50K. He's trying to put me all in. Fold, and then I'm like, fuck, I should have folded. He shows ace deuce. I shouldn't try to check raise a fucking low flush draw. I was trying to build the pot. I knew Stu was going to give it to me, but it, that was a bad play. I should have just called and continued. Then another spot, we have 510 off in the big blind at uh, 600 big blind. It goes fucking four ways flop is a five eight three it checks around turn is a five of hearts giving the back door flush draw so we have trips small blind leads for 1300 we just call other players fold now there's like 5k in the pot the river's a 10 we fill up he checks to us and i'm like thinking like what am i targeting like wouldn't he bluff would, would he bet with a straight draw i really didn't know what to do to get maximum value so i thought my best strategy was just to try to induce him to like raise me with ace high or raise me with some draw or fucking I, I don't know you know because i have the whole board so i bet only 1k and he just called was like oh i should raise you and he had 810 for three pair but it almost worked he's like oh you make me feel like a sissy i should have raised so i guess this is a good play potentially with blinds at 400 800 with an 800 big blind ante we're under the gun and we look down at eight queen suited and we're so tilted at the pace of play we limp like what the fuck another early position like plus two limps also and then this player makes it 2100 folds to me i call other player calls flop is ace 10 7 with two clubs we check other dude checks razor makes it 6500 we chase him we got like 90k behind we call the other dude calls turn is like a five not our club we check other dude checks better makes it 12k and we're like yo we chase him we degen chase him we call and the other dude calls again the river's like a two of hearts we check 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 uh better had ace jack the dude who was just calling in, in the middle of us had nine jack you know i guess he had a gut shot then with blinds at 501k with a 1k big blind annie under the gun limps and we didn't see it we look down at pocket tens in the cutoff. We make it 2,200. Big blind calls and under the gun springs the trap, makes it 12K. He's an amateur player. I should have just folded. Maybe. I call and the other dude folds. The flop comes queen, eight, seven, and he just fucking blast leads for 50K and we fold. We did win a couple hands though. We had ace queen raised it up four ways to a flop, queen high, bet, and one. Then we had a hand at 400, 800 with the 800 big blind ante. We look down at five, six of spades on the button. Early position limps, middle position limps. We make it 5K. Early position calls, other players fold. Flop comes, jack of diamonds, king of diamonds, three of hearts. We have nothing. He checks, we bet 4K, he calls. Turn is a six of diamonds, so the flush gets there and now we have a pair. He checks, we bet 12K, and he folds, good. Bluffing with the best hand is always good. So now we're going back, doing the Boski in the car. Hopefully this hand review, fucking whatever. Hopefully this vlog doesn't suck donkey cock because we fucking more got up, fuck this place, blah, blah, blah. There's a 6 p.m. flight I didn't say. Hopefully we don't have to play it. Hopefully this will be not a 3 a.m. day and we can come back fresh tomorrow with a big stack. All right, end of re-entries and, and a lot has happened. A lot has changed in our lives since I last saw you guys. We lost bullet number one. We uh, got down to like 32K, then we got it all in on a flush draw board and a lower flush draw called. We double up, early position open to 4K, dude flatted. We uh, three bet to 23K with ace jack off. A dude cold calls and then fucking jams and we thought he was making a play because he's young, because we're stupid and he had ace queen. Lost bullet one. Bullet two, we sit down and then first hand, or not first hand, like two hands in. We have 50 bigs, because it's 2K big blind. You know, 1K, 2K with a 2K big blind Annie. We're in early position with nine, nine. 
we make it 4K. Dude flats, and then this kid makes it 16K. Folds back to us, we make it like 55K, half our stack, and it folds to him and he puts it in. Um, he had Ace King, we win the flip, good. Then uh, a couple times we three bet in one, so we were floating around 200K, 210. Then there was a hand, under the gun at 1,500, 3K with a 3K big blind ante. We have pocket tens under the gun, we make it 6K. Plus one makes it 20K. Folds around back to us, we call. He has me covered, but we, we have like, you know, 200K effective. Flop comes 3-3-2 three, three, with two hearts. We check, he bet 25K. We think and call. Our hand is too good to fold. He could, he would be C-betting like over his ace king, flush draws, all types of shit. Turn is another three. So we have a full house, there's three threes on the board. We check, and he bets 35K. We think about it. Can he be doing this with nines? Is he doing this with overs as a bluff? What does he think I'm calling with? I don't know. I don't know. We call. River's like a queen of hearts, so the flush gets there, but it goes check, check, he mucked. We win a big pot. So now we have like almost 300K. We have 290K in the last break of end of re entries in the first flight. So holler at your boy, boy. All right, so we busted uh, the first flight. We got short, there were a couple ridiculous hands. What the hell was that fucking hand? We had queen, king of hearts in middle position. Raise the 10K, 5K big blind. Flop comes jack, eight, three with two diamond. Goes check, we bet 7K, he calls. Turn is a 10, so we have up and down, straight draw. He checks, we bet 35K, and he makes it 80K. We call, the river bricks out, and he leads for 100K. And then he shows fucking sixes when we fold. Another hand, we had pocket deuces. This donkey player at 5K big one makes it 15K. We have deuces on the button. We call out of our 150K. Flop is king, 10, five with two clubs and he leads for 22 and we just make it 75 with deuces and he folds and that was gangster. But otherwise in the last hand, we had ace, jack, off in a small blind with only like 80K. The big blind is 6K. Same bad player, makes it 20K from early position. We jam, he calls, he has pocket jacks, we lose. So we're re-entering the 6 p.m. flight, gonna be a long fucking night. I'm gonna take a mental break and play some stupid slots before we go back, so I'm not gonna film, but I'll play some video poker before we go back. 12 seconds later. Now that slot and video poker session didn't go well. We lost 350, but we're, we're debriefed and ready to go back to this flight and grind all night. Later. All right, so I'm here in the bushes. The only place I can film updates now that we're an enemy of this state in Golgotha. Even though they can all see me with the bright lights, it's the 6 p.m. flight. We have 90 something K, I don't fucking know. We got flush over flush and only lost 20 K. We got flush over flush, but on this one it was full flush and 120 K. What comes around goes around, fuck your mother. And that's it, we're here. Leo uh, is holding the camera, our friend. Show yourself, Leo. <laughs> what's up, what's up, guy? Parkour. <laughs> Yo, what are you doing? <laughs> I know, my bad, I don't look where I parkour a lot of the time. You heard the Australian on the break in the bushes. We're all doing all right, put up. We got DJ people's giggling at our ridiculousness real quick. This is the only place we can film here in the bushes. Katie just called us, we declined. She's probably gonna be pissed, got a fucking answer right quick. A few moments later. So we're on the next break. I got like some shit amount of chips. I got like 135K. Fuck your mom. I should probably hide in some other bushes. All right, so we're here on the next break, hiding behind this tree is our next spot. They haven't gotten to us to book out a security detail. We have 135K. Hey, huh? Tree lover? I'm a tree lover, but I'm hiding mostly from the security. Clear? Then he has a badge and a gun. Get the fuck out of here. Alright. No, so no, 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 no. Come, come along. We gotta do mad stuff. So here's the update. We punched our first buy-in on a double pair board with Ace Deuce. We three bet this guy. I don't even fucking want to recap these hands. Fuck, whatever, dude, fuck. We fucking bet multi-way on six, six, fucking three. The turn brings it back to our flush draw, which we have, so we blast again. And then the river. Eight, six, six, eight. I didn't say this hand right. Yeah. Fuck, they're on to us again. We gotta go. Go, 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 go. go. <laughs> Yo, dude. I love you. You're my favorite YouTuber. Thanks, man. Let's fucking go. <laughs> dude, it's DJ. No fucking way. That's Yo. Like a babe from here, dog. How you doing, man? <laughs> Holy shit. What are you doing here? It is the first time I'm back. They're letting me back. That's why we were oh, filming yeah. behind that thing. Yo, yeah, we're up? back. Let me do something real quick. All right. Parkour. Parkour. <laughs> Yo, that was sick. That was fucking awesome. I heard you went broke. No, I'm not trying to throw shade. That was a great parkour, but. Can I grab a picture? Yeah, dude, yeah, of course. Yeah. A few moments later. Alright, we're in the last fucking break. Mad tired. We got 91, 90k. It's like 
12 bigs now. I don't fucking know. Whatever. We haven't had many chances to shove. We got down to like 50k. Went all in incorrectly with King 8 suited. Doubled up to like 100. What? Won some random hands. I'm too tired to recap. 3.28 a.m. So we busted again. Fucking second. But yo, I'm so tired. It's like fucking 3.30, man. I'm mad cranky. A 12 bullet trip. But that's how sometimes it goes, do you know? I did make mistakes though, like with only 15 big blinds, the dude opened a 3x and we defended Jack 9 suited in the big blind. Could just fucking fold for a full 3x, like just let him have it, I don't care. Dude, wait for a better spot. And then on Ace Jack 10, he checked back the flop and then I like turned my hand into a bluff on the fucking turn, wasted chips. Very next hand, I mean, it's 4K, 8K with 8K big blind Annie out of our stack of like 250K. We look down at Jack, king of diamonds in the cutoff we open a 16k both blinds call we flop the fucking nuts and a flush draw it's nine ten queen two diamonds dream flop check check we bet fucking 10k they both call turn is a jack kind of steals our thunder kind of fucks us up but we still got the flush draw check check we bet 25k one caller river's a queen very bad fucking car Dude bets 50k, and we didn't even fucking think about it, man, and we just call. I did not play well. It's not fun playing all these flights and losing this much in a row, but I shouldn't degen re-enter so many times then. Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I'm saying, Borgata? If they had another flight right now, honestly, I'd probably play it, though. Yo, really, the moral of the story is that the Borgata fucking sucks. Everything sucks. All right. So morning the last day thank you for watching please subscribe please don't assume i lose two 12 bullets every time because sometimes we win a lot of times we win i stream on twitch eat your mom don't eat your mom you know what i'm saying no cannibal you know what i'm saying guys thank you for watching please subscribe please share please dgen goodbye i'm gonna take a last step actually so don't hang out for that we're gonna do a little chocolate cow oh my god this is so hideous the way that it scrolls on the screen are you serious this is disgusting so now we're playing this crap this f you Fu nan fu nyu. Fuck you, man. Fuck you, man. Come on, bro. And I just put in a hundred cash out, a dollar, and change. It's time we call it a day. Put the booty bounce on the dance floor. Now he doesn't deserve any applause. He called with King Jack.